Hopefully. Uh, Jay, what do you think of the recently canceled Friday the 13th movie? Uh, probably for the best. They'd fuck it up. They've been... I, they give, they give the movie to these people that made this game. They clearly have a love for the franchise. <laughs> you know the reason for not... For canceling the movie? They were going to start shooting it later this year. Uh-huh. They canceled it because Rings did poorly at the box office. That's the dumbest thing. So they're like, oh, people don't want horror reboots now. It's like, no, people just don't want shitty movies. <laughs> Re- reboots can still work. Just make it, you know. Just make people like want. at this point, Jason's been to space. You know, mm-hmm. Freddy versus Jason happened. Yeah, yeah. The remake actually got it right. I know people don't like any of those Platinum Dooms remakes, but that one got it right, and that it just feels like another dumbass Jason movie. Mm-hmm. By that... the way, you can you can turn the power off in the area by hitting that box. Hmm. Nice. All right. Nice. Jason, yeah, we we need Jason, like, on a mountaintop. No, we just need a back-to-basics, simple Jason movie. Oh, we gotta escalate. Actually, what we need is just no more. Like, I, I any all these slasher franchises, once they got out of the 80s, they yeah. all started to suck. Almost every one of them, except for Chucky. <laughs> the Chucky movies are still running strong, and they're still good. Really? Yeah. Well, now they're just doing direct-to-video ones. There's less risk on Universal's part. Yeah. Um, and they just go direct to the, the fan base. Curse of Chucky came out a couple years ago, and it was wonderful. Is um, oh, Who's the lady that voices uh, Bride of Chucky? Is she still in them? Jennifer Tilly? Yeah, yeah. she's still involved. Okay. There's a new one coming out later this year. Really? Yep. God bless Jennifer Tilly, then. Oh, she's a, she's a sport in those movies. Especially, oh, yeah. uh, you probably didn't see Seed of Chucky, did you? Uh, that one's just a straight up comedy. A lot of people don't like it. I think it's wonderful because it's so weird and subversive. Like I've seen a ton of those movies. I don't know if I've seen Seed of Chucky. I'll be honest. That's the one where they got a kid. It's like a like a, a marital drama with Chucky and <laughs> Tiffany, and they have this kid uh, that doesn't that has like gender identity issues. What? It's so fucking great what? because he's a doll, so he doesn't have you know a, he doesn't have genitals, so he doesn't know, and his name is Glenn. <laughs> But he, but he might want to be a woman, and as a woman, he wants to be called Glenda, which sure. is like a Ed Wood reference. Oh. It's fucking great. Oh my god, this sounds oh perfect. And the, and and Chucky and Tiffany, they uh, uh, they're they're going to like uh, like uh, like AA, but it's for uh, killing, or it's like they have a killing addiction. <laughs> and John Waters is in it. Oh, of course. I like that movie. Everybody hates it just because it's so goofy and it's oh, sure. like it's not a horror movie anymore, but. Oh, that sounds fun. It's completely absurd, and it was in movie theaters, which is the most amazing part. You you are causing people in the chat to download that movie right now. <laughs> so congratulations, you're ruining everyone's evening. There's one really shitty, dated, like, Britney Spears joke that kind of sucks. Oh, sure. But. Sure. Wow, I blew my opportunity as Jason here. Wow, you really did. If if another Jason comes up, I might want to grab the controller from you. Okay, Because that's fair. I have yet to play as Jason. Okay, if it so, happens again, it's all yours. Thank you. Maybe I'll play one more round, and then someone else can take over. All right. Cool. Do we want to play with the chat at any point? Let's hold off for a second. Oh. Because we have a pro- we, we tried to play that other game with chat, and they could see where we were. Yeah. And they kind of ruined it. Uh, we I'm talking it's to it's you, It's presumption. Chad. It's presumption. Yes, I am presuming, and I am presuming correctly. This mic doesn't like to stay in place. Well, oh, it needs to be tightened. <clears throat> I tighten it, and then it just... It's very slowly, but it... it well, very... these, these mics are fucking heavy, man. That's true. That is a big part of it. These mics are heavy. Oh. Also with the Chucky movies, Chucky all of movies. them written by the same guy. Really? The entire series has had a consistent uh, creative input. That makes me like which, them even more. Which, has, and which is really weird when you see how different they all are. Like, you look at the first one, then you look at Seed of Chucky, which is a, <laughs> a marital drama... Well, at that point, he's he, he's got to just be like, what can I get away with? Exactly. How can I keep this fresh for me? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Higgins Haven. Okay, you are not Jason. That's not your Jason. No. This is part three, Jason. Oh, you're hipster. <laughs> you're super hipster. Uh, let's see, he, ooh, 
Uh, Anonymous says, how are you guys with daily routines? One little thing changed in mine, and it all went to shit. I'm completely disorganized. <laughs> I'm nodding my head. You got The camera's not on me. I'm nodding my head. I'm very much not. Thank you, Jay, for doing that for me. I get upset if there is a routine. <laughs> <laughs> you're, an, you're a madman. I love my routine. It's, it's hard to have a routine when you're doing different things all the time. Um, but I try to have a general, at least like a morning routine. Yeah. Oh. I'm, I'm a, a pretty organized person. Mm hmm Probably too much so. Like, my, my routine involves change, but like, usually I have set blocks where I say, okay, this is my block where I'm going to be doing some sort of editing. This is my oh, block sure, where yeah. I'm going to be doing some sort of other work. That work can change day to day, but usually I try to block. Oh my God! Look at his face. <laughs> he was really upset. What's wrong with your face? I well, I didn't want to say that. Anonymous says I've watched some good and bad B movies, but with commentary from the guys from MST3K. A now bear trap. Tracks. Yeah. That's pretty awesome. Anyway, what? Sorry. Uh, riff tracks. They've been listening to riff tracks. B, uh, B movie riff traps. Does this count as having seen the movies, or should I see them again without it? I say enjoy the bad movie however you want to, and if you enjoy it while listening to Rift Tracks, that's how you enjoy it. Yes, it still counts as seeing the movie. Oh, police arrived. Ooh, great, someone called the police. Oh my god, oh my god, that scared the shit out of me. <laughs> Where am I going? That, I don't know. That person is I don't have a map you. either, do I? You don't have anything. No. Well, I got a machete. Oh, well, there you go. You got that. This isn't the way to the thing. Yeah, you gotta... That could... This uh, looks like a road. That's a road, yeah. I never liked Jet the skeleton back from Part 7, Jason. No? No. I think it's cool. I don't want a piece of wood. Just a piece... <laughs> How about just a piece of wood, man? As far as, like, pre-zombie uh, Jason, uh -huh. I'd probably like Part... F uh, I'm gonna say four of the best. But post-zombie Jason, I... it, the, the exposed... Uh, like backbone and all that. I think it's great. You can't have a muscular guy who is also all bones. <laughs> it's a, yeah, fucking, it's a he's, fucking contradiction. He's magical. That's true. <laughs> Deal with the magic. I I like the expo I, visually the exposed bones is neat. <laughs> I'm sorry that that breaks the illusion for you. It's a shame every violent kill got cut out of that movie. You were here for that when we did it on my birthday when we watched them all, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. And that, that was the one where, like, a kill was about to happen. Everyone's like, ah, uh, ah. Uh, and then right when the kill That's happens, right. cut away. And we all went, ah. Every, every single time. Every time. Wait, which one was that? That's part seven. That's the seven. one where he fights Carrie, basically. Yeah. Oh, right. Which is a fun concept. Uh, they had a special effects guy directing the movie. He's oh. the one who designed the look for Jason in it. But just, uh the MPAA just butchered that movie. And then you look at, like, shit you can get away with on TV now. And, it, <laughs> like, it's so, like, the movie was so tame oh, in comparison. Oh, and stuff, like, but... on basic cable, not even HBO we're talking about. Like, oh, yeah. Uh, a fucking Fargo gets away with more shit than that. Yeah. It's a different era. Oh, he's he's right over there. Do you see his, the red dot on the map? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, he's gone now. Or he's not doing... He's not doing his fast walk. I think that's what makes him show up in the radar. Oh, oh okay. Is there... And we, pro we probably talked about this when we did your birthday thing, but did you... Uh, is there a version with the kills, or are they just somewhere in a... In a there's the on the DVD and probably on the Blu-ray, there's, like, work print footage, like, really shitty, like, third-generation VHS oh, no. uh, stuff, but there's no... it. The, the material doesn't exist anymore to, like, restore it. Sure, they, no one would have thought to archive that. No, yeah, they didn't save that stuff back then, so... Oh, what a shame. Just lost to time. Yeah, it's really unfortunate, because there's some pretty good stuff. Because that's the, the one with the... Uh, sleeping bag kill and in the original cut he or in the movie the theatrical cut he smacks her once and then she's dead yeah but in the the original cut he smacks her like five six seven times and the bag is just like a bloody pulp <laughs> oh man how upsetting i i do now that you mentioned that i remember and there was a, a big enough group of us at that time where we were all psyched for each kill yeah oh man 
But then I think after that, your, we skipped... Your stamina is gone. Yeah. Let me crouch. Oh, yeah, it does grow back slightly faster. <laughs> that guy is worried. He is worried about so many things. <laughs> <laughs> okay, man. Okay, man. Okay, man. I, yeah, I think after we watched part seven, we skipped ahead to Freddy versus Jason. Oh, yeah. Because I was like, I'm not watching Jason Takes Manhattan. <laughs> Oh, is that just terrible? <laughs> it's I I kind of like it. Just I have a fondness for it, but it's it's a bad movie. Mm -hmm. Um, but that's like I think maybe the first one I ever saw. Oh yeah. And the concept is Jason takes Manhattan. Like that's great, but he spends ninety percent of yeah. the movie on a boat. Uh, in Manhattan waters? No. Oh. Well, somehow they get from Crystal Lake. They get from a lake in the Midwest, and they take a giant boat, and it ends up in New York City somehow. The, the the channel system in the Great Lakes, did perhaps? You have a, did you have a map? No. I have no idea where I'm at. I want to find that road, but... Right, yeah, you need to find the exit, because the cops are it's here now, right? probably... Oh, oh, wait, wait, there's a there's a thing there. There's a Follow the people. The people probably know where they're going. There's people south of you. There's probably Shelly's south. Pass. Ah. Nope. Oh, wait, I'm going the wrong way, then. There, there might be a map in that billboard over there. Oh, is there a billboard? Yeah. Go to the billboard. Go to your left. There. Oh, yeah. Don't go to Shelly's Pass. Shelly's yeah, Pass maps. is a reference to Part 3. Apparently, Shelly is the, the character that Jason actually gets the hockey mask from in Part 3. Oh, okay. And that guy, that actor, he's like a lawyer or something now, like an entertainment lawyer. Uh-huh. Um, but he has an account set up, and he plays this game. So you could end up actually playing with the guy that gave Jason the hockey mask in Part oh, 3. Oh, how funny. Which is kind of fun. Look at your map. Find out where you need to go. Oh, shit. I got a map now. Um, how do I access it? The little you button. gotta figure this out so I don't have to keep hitting it for you. The little button, oh. the little button next to the big. The little glowing button next button in the to middle. the glowy button. Okay. There you go. Um, oh, it's, it's, I'm wrong. It's north. Oh, okay. It's up where that red. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I totally steered you wrong, Jay. I'm, I'm a horrible person. Oh yeah, but now all the other blips are heading that way. All the all the white arrows are heading in that direction now. So you did want to go to Shelley's Pass. I did. You see? knew. Jay, your your Friday the Thirteenth instincts they kicked in. They kicked in. All right, let's see here. Candy Four Crows says, "Hey Jay, I was all ready to argue with you about the Void." Oh yeah, I didn't much care for the Void. Okay, but I thought Split sucked, so it's <laughs> almost like we can have different opinions. <laughs> Also, Jack is dumb and wrong about Moonlight. Other Cheers. way, other way, other way. Have you seen Moonlight yet? No. Okay. I need to watch that. I, I know you don't care much for it. It's uh, and it's. I don't think it's bad. I just think it's kind of meh. Yeah. Okay. All right. You can do this, Jay. You can do this. I believe in just you. Run, run, Sma oh. Just run, just run. Nice. Uh, 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 uh. Fuck. What happened? Oh shit! What happened? He's behind he got me. Scared by a body. Oh. No, he got he hit me or something. No, you got scared by the body there. Oh, is that what happened? Yeah, that's bullshit. Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, Damn it! Oh, so close, Jim. Uh, that was very close. Oh, and then I went into the tree. Oh, <laughs> that might have been an error. <laughs> oh, she's not dead. Oh, she got turned into Jarvis. Oh, nerd girl. Oh, come on. Uh, yeah, well, you could take a turn now if you want. Nerd girl's adorable. Nerd girl is adorable, Killer. I agree. She looks like the girl with the inhaler from Nightmare on Elm Street 4. Rish Evans says, uh, Hey guys, this is my first tip of many more to come. Wanted to know Jay's thoughts on Old Boy original and other Korean films in general, like I Saw the Devil and the Chaser. Oh, Fury original soundtrack. Um, I love Old Boy. I'm downloading this Fury soundtrack right now. Um, <laughs> uh, I like Old Boy a lot. I like the other kind of revenge movies made by that guy, like Sympathy, Sympathy for Mr. Vengeance and Lady Vengeance. Those are good. Um, what was the other one you mentioned? Uh, for which? For the, the... There was another movie that you mentioned. Uh, well, I, I haven't seen I Saw the Devil. That's oh, what I, I've been meaning to. I Saw the Devil and The Chaser. I have not seen The Chaser. Okay. Um, but I like the, the, the revenge movies. Old Boy is my favorite. Sorry, I got, you, you said you mentioned the Fury soundtrack, and I thought you were talking about what other bands did he mention. I, I, oh, no. I got... 
Yeah, I went through a little period where I was watching a lot of those Korean, like, uh, revenge, violent revenge movies, but that was like a decade ago, so I need to get back to that. There were some good ones. Shit. No, fuck. The William Meister says. <laughs> fuck. Hello, fire safety, George McFly, and nice. Susan. Any chance we'll see Forbidden Zone on review or Best of the Worst? It's one of my favorite cult films, and it's ripe for exposure. Uh, best. Probably. I was talking to Josh about doing that at one point, yep. so we'll, we'll probably do that. Which one is Forbidden Zone? Uh, it was originally released in black and white. It was made by the the, the band Oingo Boingo. Oh, uh, shit. Hervé Villachez is in it. Tattoo from Fantasy Island. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's it's very surreal visually. Like all the sets are built out of just like giant sheets of paper with backgrounds drawn on them. Um, Danny Elfman plays Satan at one point. <laughs> we watched it at the old old studio, Jack. You were there and you hated it. Oh, do you remember that? Oh, I fucking remember that. You you assholes loved that game. Yeah, you and Mike didn't or like that, it, yeah. and me and Josh. <laughs> Pick up a weapon, Jack. Yeah, we had both already seen it, but. There's a machete over here. Yes, you I, even, I don't even the... remember. Maybe you don't even remember what your problem with, with it was. Oh, God, it's been so long. Um, no, it was just artsy fartsy bullshittery. No, that's the exact opposite. <laughs> that is Oingo Boingo doing an Oingo Boingo thing. Oh, yeah. Fuck oh, no! I was speaking of Forbidden Zone for the person that asked that. They'll get this. For whatever reason, I had one of the Chicken Boy scenes in my head the other day. The, the scene with Joe Spinell, when Chicken Boy's mom is, is with Joe Spinell the sailor. And she's like, do you want to see him? Do you want to see Chicken Boy? I don't know why that scene was in my head. Did he get bored? I think he's waiting for me to go out the front door. I think he's still, like, fucking around with me. And if I sneak, I don't think he can hear me. No. Oh. But you're moving very slowly. Of course. This is the risk-reward, Rich. Think... Fuck. Nope, oh. he, found me. he 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 found me. This guy, you got another house. You got another house. Got another, yeah. Oh, good. Team. Team. Team power. There's someone else in the house. <laughs> I didn't even know you could do that. <laughs> Don't mind me. Yeah, if the window's closed and you're running, you just jump through it. That's great. Yeah, yeah.